I'm Greg McHale, and today I'm going to talk to you about Vortex's range finder that I use and that I carry with me in the field at all times, and it's the Razer HD 4000. With the HD 4000, it's the highest quality optics that the Razer series has and that Vortex produces, which gives you great clarity. You know, when you're looking through the viewfinder, you've got edge to edge clarity, which is hugely important. And out to 4,000 yards, so that's, uh, that's really reaching out there to something. I use it for both bow hunting and out there shooting long distance. It'll range under five yards, so it's just got an amazing amount of distance to, to really get out there and the diversity of whether you want to use it. Horizontal compensation, which is very important, especially when you're hunting in the mountains up here like we do, whether it's archery hunting or it's shooting long range, that horizontal compensation is obviously mandatory. Really, the, the quality of it, it's, it's strong, it's beefy, it's small. So with the 4000, it's scratch resistant, which obviously is, is great. <laughs> and the waterproofness, which you don't have to worry about if it gets wet. Obviously, it's electronic in there, waterproof, so if it's raining or it's the top of your backpack and everything's wet, you're going through a creek, whatever, you don't have to worry about that when it's, when it's game time. And one of the other things that I really like is that the buttons are really easy to use. So often, later season here, when I'm using gloves or you know, not even necessarily later season in the Yukon when you're up in the mountains and it's windy and it's cold and you know, you don't want to take your gloves off. The buttons are really easy to use. So that's, that's quite nice. It's simple. And that's the key is it's you hold it, you get it on, on target. And the reticle, I use the light up reticle, which is red is really nice, even in bright light. It works really well. In August, when long days, bright light, that's where I really enjoy the, having that, that red reticle. It still works in, uh, in those light conditions, which is great. Obviously, low light, that red reticle is, is perfect. So it's just kind of, it does in both conditions here for me. And I use it whether I'm archery hunting, like I said, or uh, up in the mountains. This comes with me all the time. There are situations where a guy could go to, say, the Fury, and this is the HD 5000 with the built-in rangefinder. And under certain circumstances, I will carry this as the one-stop shop. But more often than not, I've got my Razer 10x42s. You know, this is uh, this is the binocular that I carry, the UHDs all the time. So. When I have these binos, I always have the 4000 with me because as a combination, that's exactly what, uh, what gets the job done. So one of the really neat things about that I use the 4000, it's not necessarily to you know, range an animal at 4000 yards, but I actually use it to, use, to judge distances on how long it might take me to cover a particular distance over a uh, different kind of terrain. So if it's thick bush, I know that it might, I need to get three kilometers from here and it might take 45 minutes. Um, if it's downhill, you might be able to do it, to do it faster in the mountains. You know, in low light situations where you're starting to lose daylight and you need to make a decision, can I make it to that animal in time that I've seen a long way away? You actually take a range of a rock or a tree or something that you know, will give you a reference and you can make a decision whether you have enough time in the day to actually make that stock and make it happen that, that evening. That's a really uh, a neat thing about the 4000 when you're talking, it can just reach out and touch things at a long distance. So if you enjoyed this video, guys, I really appreciate the support. Um, hit the subscribe button, hammer that like, share it with your friends, and we'll uh, keep pounding out some videos for you.